Hello students. So after understanding the level of cause of disease, let's see the types of disease. Disease can be classified under two different ways. Based on the time for which the disease lasts and based on the cause of the disease. Let's understand these two types in detail. Number one, based on the time for which the disease lasts, which have just discussed in the later modules, disease are of two types, acute and chronic. Acute disease are those disease which come and they go. Very acute disease. Chronic disease, those diseases which come, they don't go. They are with you for years and years and years, affecting you, hurting you, making you very unhealthy. So acute disease are diseases which lasts for only very short periods of time. And there are no major signs, symptoms of these diseases and these are called as acute disease. For example, common cold lasts only a few days or a week. Chronic disease, ailments which can last for a long time, even as much as a lifetime, are called as chronic disease. Example, elephantiasis, a very, very common disease in some parts of India, especially Kerala. It's a very dangerous disease. Based on the cause of disease, again, there are two types. Number one, infectious disease and number two non-infectious disease when i say infectious disease which means disease caused by some infectious agent that is microorganism it can be a bacteria a virus a algae a fungi a microorganism which is causing you a disease is called as infectious disease non-infectious disease these disease they are not caused by any infectious agent, that is microorganisms. It is caused due to internal non-infectious reasons. For example, cancer, high blood pressure, infectious disease, example, influenza, amoebic dysentery. These diseases require infection to affect you. And they, you can spread these diseases from one body to the another. But you cannot spread these diseases because these diseases are from inside. They are not because of some bacteria or virus. Cancer, a very dangerous disease of today's life. Infectious disease, disease which are caused by a germ, a pathogen, a microorganism, bacteria, virus, worm, anything. Let's see some common examples of these diseases. Organisms that can cause disease are of different categories. Number one, viruses. They are very dangerous and deadly. They can attack you and cause you very, very, very harmful disease like common cold, influenza, dengue fever, and the most dangerous disease of the world, AIDS. The famous HIV virus, acquired immunodeficiency syndrome caused by human immunodeficiency virus. The next one, bacteria, typhoid, cholera, again, a very bad disease, tuberculosis caused by a bacteria, mycobacterium tuberculosis, anthrax. It's an infection, fungi, skin infection. You get white, white dots all over your skin because of these fungal infections. Protozoans, malaria, again, a very common disease because of unhygienic conditions spread by a female anopheles mosquito. Kala azur, again, a very, very, very dangerous disease because of a parasite. Worms, intestinal worms infection, Ascaris, a very dangerous worm. Sometimes they get inside your body 
and they cause you ascariasis, white, white worms inside your intestine, moving, eating, and hurting you. Elephantiasis, it's a worm, filarial worm, which enters your skin, and the part it enters, it gets enlarged like an elephant. It's called elephantiasis, very common in some parts of Kerala. Dangerous disease. So these are the infectious agents which can cause you the disease.